Here at 11, we are getting a look at body cam footage from Newtown police showing the aftermath of a chase and crash on Batavia Pike. The driver had to be flown to the hospital. WCPO 9 News reporter Jessica Hart has that new video and walks us through what happened, Jessica. Yeah, this driver was going 90 miles an hour where the speed limit is 40. He was driving so recklessly, deputies had to back down from chasing him. Eventually, he crashed, and those officers who were chasing him had to save him. Driver, talk to us! You in there? Driver! You in there? It was a race against time. This has a window breaker on it here. You are watching Hamilton County deputies in Newtown police trying to save 48-year-old Bradford Henry's life. After he put other people's lives in danger. Hey, you all right, buddy? I got moving on his arm. Henry led authorities on a chase all night. Hamilton County deputies first spotted him on Beachmont Avenue, hitting speeds up to 90 miles an hour. That's when deputies decided it was too dangerous to continue and stop following him. They stopped Henry a second time at Beachmont and Corbley Road in Mont Washington. As Henry approached the village of Newtown, officers found him behind a business. Shades of distinction. He went into there and they thought they were going to get him boxed and he said no did like a J-turn or something and then came back out. He spent off again, this time losing control and flipping his car. Is he responding to them? More than he was. The body camera footage ends with the team of firefighters placing him on a stretcher before he was taken to the hospital by air care. After he received medical treatment, Henry was arrested and currently sits at the Hamilton County Jail. The Sheriff's Office signed a warrant for Henry for operating a vehicle impaired and failing to comply with the order or signal of law enforcement. Evan.